The following trailer is rated H for honest. From the company that's not afraid to make the same movie over and over again, and people who will sell you the same video game five times, comes a mashup fighting game full of fan favorites, clinically designed to separate you from your hard-earned quarters. Marvel vs. Capcom. In a genre dominated by technical deliberate brawlers, discover an absolute clusterfuffle of a fighting game where you'll tag team some of the greatest heroes in comic book history with that giant Mexican cactus from Capcom or whatever. Then destroy all comers with a plethora of combos, supers, and team-up attacks in a mesmerizing display of special effects that will have you staring at your TV slack-jawed like a baby watching Teletubbies. The real winner is anyone who doesn't get a seizure. Select your champions from the ridiculously large rosters of Marvel vs. Capcom, from the well-known heroes and villains of the Marvel canon, as well as less popular picks like Magic Eyeball Squid and Bonespur Girl, to the classic characters of Capcom games past and present, featuring fighting game favorites with their powers amped up to Super Saiyan levels, lesser-known brawlers that can still hold their own, to characters from games that you straight up didn't know existed, and a handful of dudes that absolutely should not be fighting Iron Man. Okay, I don't know what Phoenix had in his coffee this morning, but I'm gonna need him to chill the f out. Battle your way to infinity with MVC's Manic Combat. In a battle system so crazy and chaotic, it's only a couple steps down from Mugen. With combos that go over a hundred hits, air juggles that last for minutes at a time, multiple simultaneous screen filling specials, assist attacks that come out of nowhere, and the dreaded infinite combo that will have you happily mashing away until you run into someone who actually knows how to play. Then get bodied so hard you can literally put your controller down and watch yourself get owned. I'm gonna go take a quick nap now. Just wake me up when you're finished beating my ass. Uncover the many iterations of Marvel vs. Capcom. From the game that started it all with X-Men vs. Street Fighter, an unlikely combination that pitted powerful mutants against dudes that fight on the street. And exciting tag team matchups, unless you had the PlayStation version. The sequel that expanded the Marvel side of the roster and pretty much nothing else. The first full MVC title that brought in much more Capcom madness, but screwed up the tag mode on the PlayStation once again. MVC 2, which took you for a whole new ride with three-man squads and an ass pile of assists that turned the action up to 12. The third iteration, which scaled back the difficulty and added a mode that lets you combo by slamming the buttons like a toddler. And the newest one, which drops the number, the third tag member, and all of the X-Men and adds in the gems from Marvel superheroes, Jetta from Darkstalkers, a Chun-Li so ugly they had to fix her after fans complained? I mean, I want to be optimistic, guys, but it might be time to start learning King of Fighters. So pick up your sticks, get ready to fist those cuffs, and brawl your way through this barely justified mashup today. Because if you want to see Mike Hager beating the life out of Doctor Doom with a steel pipe, there's only one place to do it. Starring Stars and Strikes, MF Doom, The Jolly Green Giant, Proton Spamming, Real Neato, Tons of Fun, Cthulhu Like, A Legged Freak, Rainmaker, Akuma Matata, Thigh Master, Titty Kitty, River Room, Sucks a Bus, A Very Good Dog, Basically Cheating, from Zero to Hero, Edge Master, and many, many more. When's Marvel? Frank West and Phoenix Wright are great and all, but where are my Power Stone and Rival Schools characters? Give me the real shit, Capcom. Comment below on what you want me to read in my epic voice. Top of the morning to you, ladies. Wowzers. There's only two dudes better than me, and I'm both of them. Bend the knee. This party's getting crazy. Let's rock.